Not to be outdone by the Cambridge family, Harry and Meghan have a shocking achievement. Hello, friends. Welcome to the latest updates from the former royal couple, Harry and Meghan. The royal quartet has always been the most sought after object of the British and American media. Recently, two families, Cambridge and Sussex, are said to be vying to assert their position. Kate and William are busy promoting the Queen's Platinum Celebration. Recently, the royal family has continuously received worrying information that both Prince Charles and the Queen have been positive for COVID. Faced with the current situation, the Cambridge family has taken on a great responsibility on behalf of the Queen and Prince Charles to influence the media. It can be said that at the present time, Kate and William are the last hope of the Queen. Both have been trusted by the Queen and entrusted with great royal responsibilities. The secret meeting between the three was revealed by a trusted royal source. The Queen said Kate and William must always be prepared to be kings and queens of the United Kingdom. This coronation may come sooner than planned, according to the Queen. Taking on this noble responsibility, Kate and William have new plans to take on the task that the Queen has assigned. Specifically, on February 22nd, Kate visited Denmark on behalf of the royal family. This is believed to be the first time the Duchess of Cambridge has taken on a royal role alone. The visit was said to be a great success as she received numerous compliments from the people. Immediately after returning to the royal family, Buckingham Palace officially announced a detailed plan of the upcoming activities of the royal family. Kate and William will take on the role of promoting the Queen's Platinum Celebration in three countries, Belize, Jamaica, and the Bahamas. The couple's departure date is March 19th. Perhaps all eyes are on Kate and William's busy schedule with the hope that they will take over their roles well instead of the Queen. The two are said to be the most favorite royal couple and receive the most trust of the people to become the future King and Queen. Returning to the Sussex family, after a period of absence, recently, Harry and Meghan announced they would attend the NAACP Image Awards in Hollywood. It is known that the couple is highly appreciated for actively propagating the issue of racism. As a side note, the NAACP Image Awards are awards for the achievements of people of color. Meghan Markle is a child of African descent, which once made her deemed unworthy of Harry after announcing they were dating. We cannot deny the achievements that Harry and Meghan have built in America. The couple has repeatedly spoken out about issues of racism in the U.S., that don't exist in the UK. In many interviews, Prince Harry has admitted he is known for the issues of racism while living in the royal family. It was only when he met Meghan that he discovered this. In June 2020, Meghan was honored for a heartwarming speech at her old high school after the murder of black man George Floyd. It can be said that the Duchess of Sussex is trusted and loved by many people in her homeland. However, for Harry's hometown, Meghan has become an extremely evil and cruel person. She is said to be the one behind Harry to govern his every move. Besides, 
Her interviews with the media are all negative when she mentions the royal family. Some people think that because she loves politics too much, Meghan has professional thoughts in all situations. She and Harry once shocked the world by claiming that the royal family was racist when a member questioned the color of Archie's skin. Furthermore, she argues that the fact that the royal family does not confer the title of prince on a son at birth is also part of this discrimination. Immediately after this interview was broadcast, the topic of royal racism immediately became a hot topic of public opinion. Many Sussex fans have fiercely attacked the royal family, especially Prince Charles when they suspected he was the one to ask about Archie's skin color. The matter became extremely complicated when the royal family was too surprised and did not find a solution. According to experts, it took a long time for Buckingham Palace to control everything. Later, Prince William personally spoke out to correct the rumor that we are not a racist family at all. This unnecessary confusion of Harry and Meghan has unintentionally made the British people hold a grudge against them and caused the relationship between them and the royal family to be seriously fractured. Returning to the achievements in the U.S., Harry and Meghan have been promoted by NAACP President Derek Johnson. Recently, Derek gave a statement to honor the merits of the Sussex family as follows. We are delighted to present this award to Prince Harry and Meghan, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, who have come together to make a call for social justice and have joined the fight for justice in the U.S. and around the world. Not only are they a shining example, the Sussexes have inspired generations to come. In addition to the call on issues of racism, Meghan and Harry are also known as activists in the field of calling for global COVID-19 vaccine equality and gender equality. With the support of the American people, many experts advise that Harry and Meghan should not return to the UK, but should focus their careers in the US. The couple was said to be quite successful during a three-day visit to New York in September 2021. That proves they have been and are very welcome in Megan's hometown. In the UK, however, people think Harry and Meghan in a different light. According to the British people, the Sussex family is a big concern of the royal family when they continuously have moves that are detrimental to the Harry family, especially the interview with chat mogul Oprah Winfrey. In addition, many people believe that Harry and Meghan also make excuses for their absence from royal events, especially the Duchess of Sussex. Last year, the British royal family held two major events, the funeral of Prince Philip, and the unveiling of the statue of Princess Diana. Meghan has been heavily criticized for being absent from both events. Recently, the Sussex family continued to confuse Netsians because they announced that they would not be able to return to the royal family if they did not have the security protection from the UK. This may be another excuse for them to be absent from the upcoming royal event. Up to now, the Queen and Prince Charles have not spoken about this matter of Harry. No one knows if the prince and his wife will return. 
As you can see, in the UK, Harry and Meghan are losing their edge. People will only support the Cambridge family because they are constantly working for the royal family. Meanwhile, the Sussex family is said to be biased towards Meghan's hometown as the couple continuously builds and contributes to American politics. What do you think about this? Let us know your thoughts below in the comments section. Thank you for following our newsletter. See you in the next videos. See ya!